Hello everybody in Robinsdale land. I'm Miss Wood. Today is April 16th, 2020, and there are no birthdays today. How are y'all doing? Oh, we miss you. We miss you so much. We miss seeing you in the halls. We miss talking to you. We miss seeing your smiles. We miss having you work hard and we get to see you learning. I even miss it when people have been calling me Miss Log or Miss Tree or Miss Brand. But we're going to see you again sometime. We can't wait to see you again because we do miss you. But we're here for you if you need us. But until all then, let's just talk about boredom. You know, the first week we were off, people were kind of excited, thinking, oh, they're going to have this time, they can do whatever they want. And then it lasted longer and longer, and then we can't go anywhere. And I don't know about you, but I get bored. Have any of you gotten bored during this time? So I am going to read you this book about bored. So I'm bored. I'm reading it with permission from the publisher, Simon and Schuster about a girl and a potato. Written by Michael Ian Black and illustrated by Debbie Ribpath Owe. And this little girl, she's sitting there and she says, I'm bored. Bored. La, I'm so bored. Hey, a potato. A potato? What am I supposed to do with a potato? She throws it over her head. It comes flying back and bumps her on the head. She stands and looks at it, and then it says, I'm bored. You want to do something? And the potato says, sure. She says, what do you like to do? Well, I don't know. I like flamingos. Well, there are no flamingos around here. Well, that's disappointing, said the potato. I'm bored. How can a potato be bored? Because I have to hang out with a kid. Kids are boring. What are you talking about? Kids are fun. Prove it, potato says. We can turn cartwheels. Boring. And skip. Boring. Or spin around in circles until we get so dizzy we almost throw up. Boring. Kids can play games and do ninja kicks. Boring. Boring. And walk on our hands, see? Boring. You know what else? Kids can imagine anything. What kind of stuff? Like this, see? I'm a famous ballerina. Boring. Look at that look she's given him. Now I'm the lion tamer with the most ferocious lion in the world. Boring. Oh yeah, well now I'm a fairy princess with my own castle and dragons and unicorns and stuff. And the potato says, snoring. Kids can swing. Boring. Kids can jump. Boring. Kids can fly. Boring. Kids can do anything. You lay she's your she's your lane. Boring. Doing science experiments. 
boring. Rockstar, boring. Pirate, boring. Boring, boring, boring. So now she dresses up like a potato. And he says, boring. How can you possibly think kids are boring when we can do all this cool stuff and think all these amazing thoughts and be anything we want to be? I'd rather be a kid than a potato any day. That she's walking away. She's very upset with this potato. And then the potato says, hey, a flamingo. Now we can finally have some fun. They look at each other. And guess what the flamingo says? I'm bored. So, boys and girls, there are some ideas of what to do in here if you're bored. But there's some others you can read. You can create a comic strip, write a book, read, always read. Create a scavenger hunt and then, and go look for things around the neighborhood, around your house. You could make a game, make your own game, board game. You can read. You can make puppets, you can put on a puppet show. Google Minute to Win It and have races in your house like that. Ask would you rather questions. You can make a movie, make a special card for someone. Draw, write riddles and share them with others. Write a song, poem, invent an animal, draw it and write about it. See, here's all kinds of ideas that you can do, you're bored. So I hope this gives you a few ideas of what to do so that you're not bored. And remember we miss you and we hope you take care and stay safe. Thank <laughs> you.